guys and welcome back to Marvel Hub. This is the Gaming Revolution here and today we have some new Spider-Man Far From Home news and information. So obviously now that Avengers Endgame is out, we are finally going to be seeing the Spider-Man Far From Home trailer 2 very very soon. Now it was reported prior to Avengers Endgame coming out that we would see this trailer before that movie did release. However, we obviously learned quite a while ago that the trailer was going to be releasing later and it had been delayed because the trailer itself contains footage that would spoil stuff for Avengers Endgame since it's going to be set momentarily after the events of Avengers Endgame and the movie will most likely show how the world has changed so much within the five years between the snap within Infinity War and then Avengers Endgame. So we're going to see how the world and how humanity was affected as a whole. I think that's going to be a big thing that this movie will explore since this is going to be an epilogue to Endgame and is going to be the final Phase 3 movie although it used to be the beginning of Phase 4 but Kevin Feige came out and said that that has been changed. So it will act as an epilogue to Endgame, but a ton of different news outlets and stuff like that have been coming out recently and saying that we are expecting a new Spider-Man Far From Home trailer coming in next week. Although they didn't give it a specific date, I think it's pretty obvious when this is going to be coming. And the reason being is because the Russo brothers came out today and said that the hashtag no spoilers uh, sort of campaign that they've been running, the ad campaign for Avengers Endgame, is going to be ending on the 6th of May 2019 next Monday. Hopefully they're, they're not talking spoilers online right well, Yeah, that's, that's what you bring up a good point because yeah. I wanted to show people at home some of the stars put up that campaign, the hashtag campaign, yes. no spoilers please. Yes. And, and, and that went viral too, but I just want to know when is it okay to talk about the movie? Is there sort of like a, a moment in time when you say, all right, I think you there can... has to be at a certain point yeah. because part, you know, part of why we make these movies is for conversation. Is that today? I think it's Monday. <laughs> Monday? I think it's Monday. Uh, really? Give people... Give it two, week give it two weekends. Give it two weekends. Know? Not everybody can get there the first weekend. But I think uh, if you haven't seen it yet, you should be out there and see it because I think by Monday people are going to be talking oh, about it. So why would that be ending on that date? Well, that's two weekends after Avengers Game Game releases, so it's given all the hardcore fans a good chance to go and see the movie. And then people who haven't seen it yet, well, that's kind of just tough luck, really. So that's when they're going to start talking more spoiler-related stuff, and it's when they're essentially giving people permission to talk about the movie without putting a spoiler warning or anything like that on social media because by then, most of the people who watch to see it will have seen it and the people who haven't seen it yet probably aren't hardcore fans so they probably won't stumble along these leaks or care about the spoilers as much but if the no spoilers thing is ending next Monday then we can only assume that that is when the trailer for Spider-Man Far From Home is going to be too because of the fact that that is obviously uh, going to contain a load of Avengers Endgame spoilers in there so it would make sense that that is when it's going to drop since that is when the no spoilers campaign is ending. Now we definitely know 100% that the trailer is going to be coming in next Monday on on the 6th of May, uh, since lots of industry insiders such as Daniel Richtman as well as Jeremy Conrad have reported that that is when it is going to be coming and they've apparently said it's going to be mind-blowing to the future of the MCU and they have hinted towards the idea of the multi-universe which was introduced within Avengers Endgame since we travel through the quantum realm to the different other universes. Well apparently Mysterio is going to be the main villain of Spider-Man Far From Home. He's going to be from another universe and and this has been reported by MCU Cosmic. I will leave a link to the article down in this video's description if you want to go ahead and check it out. But according to rumors, Nick Fury is going to introduce Mysterio to Spider-Man and say he's from a different Earth. And within the comics, the main universe, Marvel Universe, is referred to as 616, which is the Prime Universe. But there are infinite other universes now that the multiverse has been introduced in Endgame. Now, obviously, we saw Thanos within the final battle in Avengers Endgame came from the past to the present. So I'm assuming because we travel through the quantum realm within Avengers Endgame, Game. Although Captain America did replace all of the Infinity Stones at the end of the film, I do think it has caused ripple effects to the universe, which is going to break up all of the continuity, and it is kind of worrying for the future of the MCU, because it means that any time a character dies, are they really dead when there's an infinite amount of other universes they could just come back from? You know what I mean? Even though Tony Stark died within Avengers Endgame, what if another Tony Stark comes from another universe to our universe? Also, even though we killed Thanos within Avengers Endgame, he could definitely return within a future movie, because he could just come from another universe. You know, the fact that there are an infinite amount of universes now means that there's so many infinite possibilities for what could happen. But yeah, it will be coming Monday. So, this trailer has been announced today that it will be featuring a 
spoiler warning from Tom Holland himself at the start. Now, alongside that today, we got a new Spider-Man Far From Home image released today from Total Film, which you can see on screen. So it's just Tom Holland within the airport and they are checking his Spider-Man suit. They will most likely make a joke about it because they're just like, what the hell is this? They're probably like, why are you dressing up like this? And yeah, we're just going to have to see how everything plays out since uh, Spider-Man isn't world known like the Avengers and stuff like that. So anyways, thank you for watching the video. Make sure to subscribe if you're not here for the latest and greatest Marvel news and information. So anyways, thank you for watching and uh, bye.